The Nebraska Department of Education School Safety and Security team are pleased to provide you with the recordings from a two-part webinar series to support your school's postvention efforts. This series is a joint effort between NDE and the University of Nebraska Public Policy Center. It is supported through the Garrett Lee Smith Youth Suicide Prevention Grant. Nebraska School Safety's model supports Nebraska schools in prevention, preparedness, response, and recovery. Visit the NDE School Safety website for a wealth of resources to assist with your efforts. When you visit the School Safety website, you'll also find the Suicide Prevention website with links to a wide range of resources for schools and families. Also, please visit the NDE School Safety YouTube channel for additional resources. This site is continuously being updated with resources to address current needs and concerns. Schools need to have three critical elements in place to keep students safe and secure. They need to have a threat assessment team trained and in place, and they need to make sure that every student has connections with at least one adult in the school. The other component is having an anonymous report system in place. We're very fortunate that our state legislature has passed funding so that every school in our state can provide safe to help at no charge. This system provides immediate contact with a live crisis counselor 24 hours a day. You can find information about Safe to Help on the School Safety website. I would like to now introduce our webinar series host, Dr. Scott Poland. Dr. Poland is internationally known in the area of school crisis and suicide prevention. He's the author or co-author of six books on the subject and has assisted many communities after youth suicide point clusters, including several in Nebraska. He worked full-time as a psychologist in the schools for 25 years and currently directs the Suicide and Violence Prevention Office at NSU Florida. He frequently consults with schools experiencing a crisis. His two-part webinar series has been broken into shorter segments to allow easy access for school personnel. Please feel free to contact our school safety team if you need further assistance.